I just want to leave my parents' house to be with this man. I want to live here. I want to live with him. I want to stop this uh, going and coming back. You know, always checking the time whenever I'm with him that I have to rush back home. I was just, that was the major thing for me. Like, I just wanted to stay with him. I just wanted to be with him. <laughs> guys welcome back to my channel if you are new on my channel you're very much welcome my name is Arnold <laughs> so do not forget to subscribe to this channel in that way you become a member of the family of this channel because we are family members here yeah? yes we have family members so if you're a subscriber then you're one of our family members so click the subscribe button down below and there's a notification bell beside the subscribe button please click on that so you get notified whenever i upload a new video so as you can see from the title of this video today i'm going to be talking about things that i wish i knew before i got married like you know we always have these expectations and many things we go into marriage with our own expectations so today i'm going to be discussing the things that i wish i knew before i got married so the number one thing is that not all your expectations will be met okay so i i walk into my marriage you know i've been this um ramzonia and genevieve you know thing things they show in movies you know like if you're not a nigerian um <laughs> and uh, ramzonia and genevieve or motola all these people they're just nigerian um nonywood actors and actresses they they are more into romantic scenes so they you know they give us this picture of you know how a relationship should be, how a marriage should be, and things like that. So, those things are not real, you know. <laughs> not all of them are real. And I wish that I knew that um, I should like have less expectations. So, when there's a disappointment, like when you're not getting what you expected, then the level of disappointment shouldn't wouldn't be too high. So, it's good not to have like high expectations, you know, so that you don't get disappointed a lot. Like this is real life, not movie, you know. <laughs> All right, so the next thing that I wish I knew or I wish somebody told me about before I got married is that marriage takes a lot of work. <laughs> like, you need to work to make it work. Really, you need to work to make it work. Like, I mean, forgiveness is work. Being selfless is work. Many things. Like, you're committed to this person. Like, you're sharing everything. Your life, your future, you're, you're going to be sharing everything together. So, it's a lot of work like a lot of work because you guys are two different people coming together so you need to like do a lot of work to kind of blend in into each other so i wish i knew earlier <laughs> that it's not gonna be smooth every time you have to work to really make it work okay. so another thing i wish i knew before i got married is that love is a choice like loving somebody is a choice you have to make because sometimes you get frustrated you get like you're not so much into each other like you used to be but if you have this thing or if you have this intention or determination i'm gonna love you no matter what like you need to be determined you need to choose to love this person you need to choose to stay with this person no matter what you need to choose to like to say okay no matter what the situation no matter the weather no matter everything i'm gonna stay i'm gonna stay by your side so loving someone is a choice it is not just what this is beyond our feeling like it's beyond what we feel because you, you have to make that decision you need to be determined you need to make it that oh yes i want to love this person regardless of what may come another thing i wish i knew before i got married is that marriage cannot fix you it cannot fix anyone so if there's something that you're not comfortable with in your partner you need to work it out before you go you get married because that marriage is not going to fix that thing like you need to fix it before you get married you need to address that issue you need to address whatever issue you think you can't cope with or you can't live with you need to address everything talk about it before you get married because that marriage is not going to make the person change don't think that when when i get married it's going to change or she's going to change it's never going to happen actually marriage will instead manifest what you have never seen about the person and even what the person have never seen about herself so that is just the, how it works so marriage is never going to fix you or your partner so i wish i knew this thing 
before I got married. Thank so you. another thing I wish I knew before I got married is that marriage would make me get busier. Like I was thinking, yeah, when I get married, I'm gonna leave. Because my, to be very honest, when I was getting married, I was more concerned about leaving my parents' house. I just like, I want to be with this man. <laughs> I don't, I don't want to, I don't I want to stop this either sick thing, like, I don't want to, because my mom is a very, very sweet person. Each time I, I, I went to visit my husband, like, my, my fiancé, now husband, like, maximum I should be home, like, 6.30 p.m. or 6 p.m., like, no, no lateness, you have to come home early, so, my, my old thing, the old thing on my mind was that I just want to leave my parents' house to be with this man. I want to live here. I want to live with him. I want to stop this uh, going and coming back. You know, always checking the time whenever I'm with him that I have to rush back home. I was just, that was the major thing for me. Like, I just wanted to stay with him. I just wanted to be with him. And I didn't know that getting married would actually make me get busier. I thought, Yes, I have the old, when I'm with him, I have the old time for myself. Then we can, you know, explore, we can do many things and, you know. But instead, marriage makes you get busier, is especially when you start having kids. Oh my God. Because you have your personal life to, to pursue and he also has his personal life. He has his friends, many things. Like there are so many calls you won't be able to take. There are so many invitations you have to refuse. Many things will come up that you won't be able to to do anything about it, you'll be able to go. Many events will come up and you won't be able to go. Many things like that will happen. Like, I, I wish I knew these things before <laughs> before I got married. Like, I wish I knew that, okay, you're gonna get busier, not any less busy. No, you get busier instead. Okay, guys, <laughs> so the next thing that I wish I knew before I got married is that I wish I knew that getting married would change your relationship with your own friends because uh, when you get married like naturally you're supposed to like take your partner as your best friend it should be your best friend someone you can tell everything so at that moment all the just 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 things you used to have with your friends like they, there has to be a limit to it your husband should be that one person that you can tell everything so the relationship between you and your best friend or your friends it has to be limited because you're married just because you're married so i wish i really knew these things before i got married yes all right guys so these are the things that i personally wish that i knew before i got married because knowing these things i believe will help me to prepare ahead prepare will help me prepare for what is ahead of me like I, I would know what i'm supposed to expect what i'm supposed to do or what is expected of me you know so those are the things that I wish I knew. Yeah. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you learned something from me and I hope that you're going to share this video with your friend. Click also on the like button and also subscribe to my channel if you like this video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget that we can also connect with each other on Facebook and Instagram. There are so many things I post there that I cannot post on um, YouTube, you know. So guys, if you want to know about the, <laughs> the weekly or anything I do during the week, you can also follow me on Instagram and Facebook. Thank you guys for watching this video. I'll see you in my next one. Bye.